Hey, what is going up, you guys? It is XXX, Omar Sanchez XXX, and today I'm going to be giving you my top five city uh, applications and tweaks of uh, May 2013. Um, I'm currently running iOS uh, 6.1.2 on the iPhone 4S, jailbroken through Evasion. So if you're wondering if any of these tweaks will work with your iOS device, yes, it does work on 6. Point, um, iOS 6.0 and above, obviously. Um, so coming in on number one, I'm going to be showing you my number one uh, favorite tweak, and it's called Folder Enhancer. This could be found in the City of Store. It is by, uh, as you can see, Lance Fetters. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that correctly. Um, what this allows you to do is pretty much customize your folders. As you can see, it has a nice little animation when you open my folders. Um, I don't have too many icons in here right now, but if there were, I could um, pretty much page it. Um, you're also allowed to put folders and folders on uh, just like that. Let me just show you an example right now. I'm going to just put these together. And then I'm just going to drag this in this folder. And as you can see, folder and folder. So yeah, that's um, I find that pretty cool. Uh, coming in on number two on my list uh, is going to be... I'm just making this right now. It's Icon Renamer. Now this could be found in the city store. I'm not sure how much it is, but I'll post an annotation along with it. Um, what this allows you to do is like the actual name is it's rename your icons. For example, this is Shazam Red. I was annoyed with the fact that it said Shazam and then in parentheses red. So um, if you look here, if I were to double tap it while I'm in jiggle mode, um, it'll allow me to change it. I can change it to anything I want. I just select the ply and it'll change it. Uh, that's pretty much icon renamer. Uh, that's pretty simple. I find it very handy um, if you have like really long names and you have your applications together and the names are either overlapping or it's too much. Uh, coming in next, next on our list is Spring Optimize. Now what Spring Optimize actually allows you to do is fully customize your springboard. If you're not entirely sure what your springboard is, it's pretty much everything, how you actually use your device. It could be animations when you open applications, customize your dock, your lock screen, icons customize folders and stuff like that for example what I like to do when I'm using a theme is I like to go into icons and I like to resize my icons to 85% um, it looks nice around there you can actually do more than just 85% you can make them bigger smaller and after you do that you just pretty much select reload and it's going to resize my icons to how I selected it I'm um, just let my iOS device boot up and then I'll show you all right, now that my device is loaded up, I can just easily uh, look at my icons, see how they're much smaller. It looks so much cleaner, and this is a great add-on when you're using Icon Renamer because it looks even better. See, it looks clean and simple, even change the icons on my dock. All right, guys, coming to next on our list is uh, and actually um, this is an application. Uh, it's called Movie Box. Um, I'll post a link in the description of what repo you can get this from. But I'm pretty sure you can just easily search it. It's just spelled regular movie box. There's a space in between. And what movie box is, it's pretty much just like Netflix, except it's absolutely free. Let me not say just like Netflix, because it's actually better than Netflix, guys. It offers brand new movies that are probably still in theaters in HD quality, guys. Um, for example, we have Iron Man 3 here, Good Day to Die Hard, stuff like that. 21 and over you can even search movies guys, which is absolutely amazing um, They have even a TV show section So I like to catch up on my Walking Dead sometimes on here you they have all three seasons guys Breaking Bad all that good stuff and You can what I even like about this application is that you can even go into more and you can even order a movie and Request it and um, I'm pretty sure if in due time they will post it on here, but I absolutely love this application um, last but not least, I'm going to be showing you the last um, uh, actual application. I don't know why I'm going in there. It is called GPS Phone. Now, what GPS Phone is, if you're not familiar with it, is an act it's actually a Game Boy Advance and Game Boy Color emulator. Now, f in order for this uh, emulator to work, you need to download the BIOS. Um, you can do this by easily opening up the applications, so go into the search bar um, icon in the top right. And it says Game Boy Advance BIOS page can be found here. You just select this. And then once you're on this page, you simply just scroll to the bottom and select download now. Then once it's installed, you can easily just go back into the search bar, search any Game Boy Advance or color game you want. And it's absolutely amazing. Um, I've been actually addicted to Herbs, The Sims in the City for a while now. 
uh, pretty much what happens is once you load it up, uh, since they're still in the beta stages, it's free currently. So if you want to get this, I'd get it now because it's probably going to go up to $6 later on. But once you select uh, a game, all you have to do is wait. Um, I, mine, I pretty much have like the worst advertising right now. It's a video that's loading. Uh, I'm going to let this finish loading. It might take a while. It's going to load up a video. All right, look at that. It skipped it for me. That's even better. Um, but yeah, as you can see, there's some controls. I'm going to finish up this video by showing you. It does work in landscape mode. Um, it offers a few features. If <laughs> Let me show you. Probably did that too fast and have done that on the main menu. Let me go back into it. As you can see, it does have some problems. Um, that's just like the very first time it's ever done that to me. Um, but, you know, it's still in development. That's why it's free currently. It does work very well most of the time. Um, the only problem is it's probably the stupid advertisements they have on it right now. Usually it just gives you like a Candy Crush advertisement, but for some reason today they switched it up and put a video. And as you can see, videos aren't doing any justice for this. Uh, but yeah, hold on guys. Come on, GPS phone. Alright, there we go. It's loading. And now let me show you something by putting down the volume first of all. If there's a little icon here that's menu, um, you can actually save the state. Um, and what that allows you to do is just like actually free browse and whatnot, other applications while you're playing. And uh, you can even do cheat codes like Game Shark and whatnot. Um, my GPS phone is actually being stupid right now, so I don't even want to show you that application. If you don't want it, you don't have to get it. Um, but yeah, uh, that pretty much wraps up the end of this video, guys. Thanks for watching.